In Denmark, elevators often have a button marked I fart, meaning in motion, in Danish. When Queen Elizabeth II visited Denmark in 1960, these buttons were covered with strips of tape in any elevator she used. Walt Disney had a hidden apartment constructed within Disneyland, allowing him to observe the visitors in his theme park secretly. Ernest Hemingway once received a six-toed cat named Snow White. Today, 40 to 50 of Snow White's descendants, many of them also six-toed, still reside at his former home in Florida. Holding in farts too often can lead to the gas being reabsorbed by the body and eventually exhaled through your breath. James Buchanan was the first and only bachelor president of the United States. His niece, Harriet, served as the first lady during his presidency. The Milano cookie was made because the original Pepperidge Farm cookie, called Naples, would stick together in hot weather. By putting two Naples cookies with chocolate in the middle, they made the Milano. Petra, a female black swan, became famous in Germany for her attachment to a swan-shaped pedal boat, which she followed and stayed close to for two years. After disappearing, prompting a nationwide search, Petra was eventually found years later, this time accompanied by a real swan. Iwao Takamoto, the creator of Scooby-Doo, intentionally designed the character by identifying traits desired in a top show dog and then drawing Scooby-Doo with the opposite characteristics. The final words of Winston Churchill, the former British Prime Minister, were reportedly, I'm bored with it all. Clint Eastwood, despite spending a significant part of his acting career on horseback, is allergic to horses. During the filming of The Breakfast Club, Judd Nelson, who played Bender, remained in character even off-camera, often tormenting his fellow cast members, especially Molly Ringwald, who portrayed Claire. Ingvar Kamprad, the billionaire founder of IKEA, liked to save money a lot. He encouraged his employees to save paper by using both sides and was notably turned away from Businessman of the Year Award for arriving by bus. He also assembled all his furniture himself. The first episode of The Crocodile Hunter featured Steve Irwin and his wife Terry trapping and handling crocodiles on their honeymoon. Andrew Carnegie and John D. Rockefeller, two extremely wealthy entrepreneurs, sent each other gag Christmas gifts. Rockefeller sent Carnegie a cardboard vest to make fun of his poor childhood. In return, Carnegie sent a fine whiskey to Rockefeller, a devout Baptist who had given up drinking. The Nintendo character Kirby was named in honor of John Kirby, the lawyer who successfully represented Nintendo in their 1982 lawsuit against Universal Studios. During its production, Snakes on a Plane was temporarily renamed to Pacific Air Flight 121. However, Samuel L. Jackson, a lead actor in the film, insisted on reverting to the original title. He expressed that the unique title was the primary reason he accepted the role. Kit Kats gained immense popularity in Japan, partly due to their name sounding similar to the Japanese phrase Kitokatsu, which translates to surely win. This led to the belief that Kit Kats could bring good luck, making them a favored snack, particularly before exams. In 1957, during his visit to Disneyland, President Harry S. Truman declined to ride the popular Dumbo attraction. As a Democrat, he didn't want to be photographed in an elephant, which is the symbol of the Republican Party. In 2000, Henry Cavill, then a 16-year-old aspiring actor, had a fortuitous meeting with Russell Crowe. Crowe later sent him a gift box accompanied by a note that read, Dear Henry, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step, Russell. Remarkably, 13 years later, Cavill and Crow starred together in Man of Steel. Red Sour Patch Kids are the exact same candy as Swedish Fish, just with the sour sugar. While filming The Godfather, production was interrupted by Joe Colombo, a real-life mafia figure. Producer Al Ruddy met with Colombo to go over the script, resulting in the complete removal of the word mafia from the movie. Colombo and his associates also influenced casting decisions and even appeared as extras in the film, 